So, American Dream, can you hear me? Am I coming through the, the airwaves loud and clear? How would you act confused? You said, why is Tyree Steed mad at me? It's very obvious why I'm mad at you. I left you a comment saying so. You're slandering my girlfriend's name and talking shit that doesn't exist and makes no coherent sense like you always do. Why do you continue to do that? And when will you stop? It's a pretty clear-cut problem. It's been the same problem from day one with you. Okay? Um, you've put me through a lot of stress because you just start making up shit, slander shit on my name. You're not going to do it to my girlfriend. And I can't make you stop because I'm not around you physically. But that's why I'm asking you, can you please take that video down? And can you stop your bullshit? Because nobody said or did anything your way. Jenny's been nothing but nice to you. Okay? And she doesn't deserve that. And that's what I don't understand is this enmeshment shit. The trying to violate people, like I said. Trying to violate people for no reason, out of the blue. Um, you know what I mean? And then trying to enmesh with them and force your way, like... And then their life, kind of, I guess, or something. Uh, I really don't know. I mean, I don't know how this shit works. It's, it's pretty fucking weird. You want me to be realistic with you? You know? But uh, I don't understand it. I'm sure there's plenty of people who don't understand it at all. You know what I mean? So it is what it is. You know what I mean? Hopefully, hopefully they'll figure it out. And, I don't know, you know, I mean, people get online to do different things, it's weird, um, but yeah, I have spoken, now I'd like a response to what I said to you, American Dream, I'd like you to take down the video like I've asked you to, it's that simple, my point is, I don't care about your donations, I don't care about your little drug money, I don't care about you claiming you're a supporter and part of the inner circle, well, then using your own logic against you, because you're not very smart, apparently, this is what happens when you act stupid. Using your own logic against you, if you were part of the inner circle, which includes <clears throat> Jenny, Raleigh, right, and me, and you, why would you be hating on and trying to destroy your own team? Unless you were an agent. Dare I say it? So see, I was ready for this, kind of. I mean, not, not completely, but it was kind of surprised me. But I've already seen you do shit like this. So it's not really a surprise once I saw you do it. So it's like, are you that stupid? I mean, I mean, it is what it is, bro. I mean, like I said, that's why like, people like Dream... I'll always make sure that I get the best of because his intentions are always malicious. And I think he really thinks that, like, it's some kind of fucking game. Like, nah, bro. These are people's lives, homie. You know what I mean? Like I said, y'all get on YouTube to bullshit. We get on YouTube being our real selves, living our real life. Do we joke around? Yeah. But no, it's not pretend land on YouTube. It's not... Delusionville, you know, there's rules you have to follow and standards you have to abide by. And that's the truth. If you don't like it, get off of YouTube. Because, I mean, once you start bending the rules of reality just because you're on YouTube, that's usually when people get hurt or killed. Right? Just like anything online. Any social media. So that's why the things these people say make no sense. They talk about the same things all the time. They were talking about a court case for a long time. I never planned to really take y'all to court. Like, I just plan to see you and handle you. You know what I mean? Like, wh what do you not understand? And all I was trying to do is alert you, hey, you're breaking the law. I mean, if you don't want to listen, we can go a whole nother route. It's all good. I'm used to that route, you know, but like I said, it just doesn't make any coherent fucking sense, and it's pathological envy and jealousy, and it's coming from the same people, and we all know that. 
we all see through your fuck shit. You know what I mean? And my point is, what are you trying to show me? And what is the message that you people who hide from me and then say I'm running from you, what are you trying to tell me? Because I'm not interested. I could give two fucks. I don't like you. I don't know you. You don't hold any power or relevance to me. I'm the star. I'm the boss. I'm bigger than 50 cent in the world. I'm Tyree fucking Sneed. I own a mansion. I own a bunch of fucking luxury cars. All right. All my shit is paid off and paid for outside of my taxes on my home. Like pretty much anyone. Okay. Especially Freemasons. They don't even get to that point because they don't even own their homes. So I'm ahead of everybody in the world as of now. You'll have to acknowledge that. And I'm not running from anyone. How do you have a hold if what you're saying doesn't exist? They really want to pretend like that to cause me anxiety and stress like, yeah, he's scared of people. I don't know what I'm scared of. I mean, other than being harassed and bothered and fucking yelled and screamed at by fucking weird ass people. Like, yeah, I'll get away from that. That's called abuse. I don't understand how that makes you feel special inside. But that's pretty fucking corny, ain't it? <laughs> but yet, I'm out here living my young life, right? Being successful with the girl I love, who I'm about to marry. I'm about to get married. All right? And you think, with what I'm going through physically right now, you think I got time to worry about little bullshit-ass people on YouTube, the same people? Not at all, homie. I'm out here doing me. If people like the content, cool. If they don't, fuck them. Okay? But it's not okay what you did, Dream, and you need to accept and understand that. It's not okay at all, and it's not excused. And you're not going to normalize abuse with us, period. You know what I mean? I've learned your game. Your game is to try to bother people. You know what I mean? It is what it is. You don't bother me, but I can't have you bothering who I love and who I'm with either. So like I said, I can't make you, but I'm asking you, take down the video. And I just think you're a fucking faggot for that, like a lot of things that you've done. Real shit. I mean, that makes you look bad, bro. That ain't cool. Shit was whack as fuck. I'm just being honest with you. So, I mean, if that's what you want to do with your time, cool. But, I mean, can't you take that shit somewhere else? Like, take it to people who want to do that shit. You know what I mean? There's fucking plenty of people in the world. We got to tighten up this belt. There is plenty of people in the world. Okay. And if there's people like me who tell you, hey, look, look, buddy, I understand what you do online. I don't want to be a part of it. And, you know, you better respect that. I don't understand how that ain't how that's such a problem. Dude, what the fuck? I thought this was a good bill. This thing is too fucking it's either too tight or too loose. Fuck on. Uh, hold on. So, like I said, the weird ass shit on YouTube, the obsessing and all that, I mean, that ain't my thing, homie. My job is to not let that shit bother me. Your job is you want to obsess? Okay, you don't get paid for your job. At least when I go to work, I get paid. I'm just saying. I mean, at least when I turn on the camera, I ain't worried about views because I know I'm making money. I'm just saying. Maybe the game should be a little different on here. Like, for real. Maybe y'all should get your priorities a little bit straighter for once in your fucking scum-sucking worthless life. Like, maybe you should stop trying to talk down on people and make yourself look stupid. 
not making any sense, insulting people, berating and yelling and screaming at them for no reason, right? Maybe you should quit that, and maybe your shit would get a little bit better. But as long as people are doing that, and that's what they waste their time doing, they ain't going nowhere. It's that simple. So it is what it is. I mean, Tyree Sneed's a pretty big deal, bro. I mean, I held my own fucking mansion down for two years, all of COVID, with a warrant out for my arrest. If that ain't gangster, I don't know what is. And ain't nothing y'all can do about it. Or them. That's pretty gangster shit. That's basically saying, fuck you, Spicks. I don't answer to you. Suck my white dick, which is what my message is. You understand? Those people put me on a fake probation. Hell no. Nah. Y'all thought you was going to get away with that? Nah, homie. It's personal. You understand? That's why I called that chief up and aired him out like twice. Because I want y'all to know who I am. I mean, I don't get it. He asked me one time even. He was like, are you at 305 Balboa? I'm like, yep. He didn't come arrest me or nothing. See, it's not even them. The new ones, they're all new, new uh, deputies and shit.